hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video so today i'm going to be relaxing my hair so i haven't relaxed my hair for two months now last time i relaxed my hair was in december i think 24th or 23rd so it's been like full two months now i was actually planning to um keep it for like another month and um do it at three months but my hair is like breaking because i have a lot of uh growth especially in the back that um and it's actually causing like strain onto my uh relaxed hair my hair is actually breaking because um the bottom is too afroy and the top is too thin so i was thinking of doing like a treatment and then push for another month but i just decided to just go ahead and do a relax today i'm going to go ahead and relax my hair because i want to braid it and i want those braids to last for like maybe like another two to three weeks so first thing first i'm going to part my hair so i want to part it into four Actually, the bag, I'm just going to do like one go, but in the middle of here, I will put some Vaseline and now I'm going to apply some Vaseline. So this is going to protect my scalp and skin from burning because the relaxers can like burn you. So I'm applying it on my edges and on my ears as well. So like the whole perimeter of my um, head. And I'm also applying it in the middle here because the relaxer that I'm using um, today is really, really strong. It does its job. Like it's the relaxer that I used last time when I was actually doing like my first relaxer. Um, it's really, really strong, but it does its job and it works really, really fast. I don't know if it was just my hair, but... I found that it actually works really really fast but I love the results so that's what I'm gonna use today so I'm just applying it on right here in the middle on the partings so the relaxer that I'm using today is the dark and lovely uh, fat protein defining relaxer which looks like this and I like buying the individual than the pack because I feel like after you've activated the pack and everything you can't really use it i've used it i used this one last year when i was doing my hair um and i used half of it i still have half of it which is what i'm going to use so before i do that i'm just gonna put a glove i'm gonna put one because on this side i'm gonna i'm going to be holding a brush and i end up just taking it off anyway so so i'm just gonna go ahead and start applying it from the back coming to the front
so now that my hair is fully saturated with the relax i'm going to go ahead and mix it through just with my hand and i'm taking like a white tooth comb they say don't um, comb your relaxer but I always do it I feel like it helps like just like um, getting everything coated and relaxed and even in the saloon they do it so So I'm gonna leave this sitting for another like five minutes and then I will go ahead and rinse but I want to show you guys the products that I'm going to be using because I'm not gonna be filming in the shower so first thing first neutralizing shampoo you need neutralizing shampoo if you're relaxing your hair so I'm using the same Doug and lovely neutralizing shampoo and this one is also the fat protein one I use this about three times so you, you kind of like have to use it until your bubbles turn white instead of pink. But I always just use it like three times. I feel like three times is safe. So I'm going to use three, this three times. And then once I'm done with the neutralizing shampoo, I'm going to use my normal Tresemme shampoo. And this one is the Cleanse and Replenish um, shampoo. And then after that, I'm not going to use the conditioner, but I'm going to use this Cantu Leave-In Conditioner. I'm going to apply it on my hair while it's still damp leave it for about five minutes while i'm still in the shower and then rinse it off and then i'll come back and show you guys the final results and we can do like some trimming and whatever so i am back now with my hair all clean and conditioned and this is how it looks it feels so <laughs> light and breathable so i'm just taking my blow dryer and i'm going to dry it So now my hair is dry and before I go ahead and moisturize it, I'm going to do a little bit of trimming. So I'm just going to trim off the ends. I was always scared of trimming my hair. I feel like I'm losing my hair because my hair doesn't really grow that fast. But I realized, actually I learned that um, by doing like trimming the ends, it actually makes your hair looks health, look healthy and um, it also make it look thicker, which I always want because my hair is like naturally thin. I don't really have a lot of hair on my head. Um, let me know in the comment section if you uh, know or believe that trimming makes your hair grow faster because I don't know about that but I just love that it looks healthy and fuller.
and to moisturize my hair i'm going to be using this black chick hair food and this one is the coconut one so i'm going to do this in like small sections and i'm applying it on my scalp first And I'm also taking some of it just for the top. And then I'm taking back my blow dryer just to melt it and get everything like saturated. And I'm going to be using my retro comb. So I'm not going to style my hair, I'm going to leave it like this because I'm going to be braiding it this weekend. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and don't forget to enable the notification bell so you don't miss any future uploads and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!